gentlemen. My name is Gabriel Rasmi, and I'm here tonight to present a small workshop for you. That is, uh, could you remember the last session? Yes. What it was about? Boundaries. It's about boundaries. And as a continue of this workshop, we will uh, say something which is a little bit briefly defining what is boundaries and giving some tips about how to apply this uh, boundaries in our life. So, we are here tonight actually to define just one word. What is it? This is our goal. We will try to practice ourselves how to say no. It's easy for us. It's easy for us. We, as I appreciate your uh, your patience, your patience, and I'm also want to thank Dr. Ahmed and uh, Russia for uh, and uh, who said uh, is resilience here and here and seven habits here and most of the goals here and. Uh, because when we uh, Marwa said uh, something a little bit about uh, responsibility or so when we are here to gather it, uh, 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 together and to say no or to help to make control of our life so this is what actually is based on the famous book of boundaries by Dr. Henry Cloud and John Townsend and uh, here is our objectives first one is to define personal boundaries and differentiate between types of boundaries we recognize when we need to set up boundaries and compare between gentle and good boundaries so we have four objectives tonight beside to the text Last uh, session we defined bound as who remember limits. limits. This is your limits of uh, being a, a human. So we have limits around you, and we here tonight to to know how to build these limits together or around you. What is boundaries? This is limits we need to set in our life lives to protect what is the most important to us. Let's see what is important to us or to find what is important to us. I know it's different from one to another and it may be a little bit confusing because what is important for you it might be less important or nothing for me. But there is a common importance for us like uh, what's important for you, the most important in your life. Give me an example. Success. Success. Family. Good. Education. Education. And what about career? Huh? You forgot yourself. Myself. You forgot that you are you are a part in this life. You forget yourself. You, you forget that you are Consider yourself as a part in your career, in your life. So, when we have no boundaries, when we have no boundaries, yes? Sorry, but if you are trying to find the most important thing, that's you want to please yourself. So, actually, you are trying to find happiness for yourself, right? Not to find happiness. Or satisfaction for yourself. A mm, little bit, yes to find satisfaction, but satisfaction not to, not to gather something from abroad, it's from it, from inside yourself, yes, just to say no, okay? We always want to be a pleasant and want to be a thankful and want to be a little bit uh, not true to others and we say no, regardless of what is this word is, it means, it's a proper or not. So, having no boundaries is uh, cause hosting and resentment and slowing anger. 
I'm feeling anger. A lot of time. Notice that. When we don't have boundaries. No respect to me. For, 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 for who? For you. You feel that no one you feel that. Yes, you feel that no one respects me. You feel angry. You feel exhausted. Like if somebody asks and you, you uh, if somebody yeah. keeps yeah. asking you questions or keeps asking favors from you, yes. sometimes you feel great. You cannot tell them yes. no, I don't want to do this. You 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 keep it saying yes, yes, yes and you are angry, and you don't know why you are angry. You are pleasing others, you are giving favors, you are giving money, you are giving e efforts, and you are angry, still angry. <coughs> yes, because actually in this case, you will be exhausted in yes. the action plans of others, instead of his own action plans. Mm -hmm. So he will be exhausted and always, always being angry. Yes. Now, when we... Yes, yes. But if you notice, but if you say no, for example, you might also not be fulfilling your part or role in, in certain situations. Sometimes. Or maybe the people they will uh, consider you as uh, art or yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Answering this question will be in the end of the part and when we say uh, no and when we say yes and how could we uh, differentiate between yes or no and the proper time. But now, when we should say no, or how we we feel that it, it's the, the time now to uh, say no. Would anyone give me an example? When I don't have the ability to do that, uh, I will this, stress myself to do it. You stress yourself. So you you feel the feel is outside or inside? Uh, no, inside. Inside. So let me give you a hint that every one of us has a has Final indicator that he feels that his boundaries, his limits, his body, his mind, his thoughts, his money huh, being violated from us. This is your healthy, perfect zone. This is the world, your family, the big distance we are living in. And this is your health zone. So, we shouldn't be over involvement to the outsiders or under involvement. Yes. This is a very good slide, but uh, really, can, can you tell us more about it? Yes. Because you are inside a lot of situation, you are working and you have a family and you have friends and colleagues, okay? okay. And sometimes you have a different things. You have social commitments, you have political, and you are enjoying a bar or something like that. So you have a lot of things around you. You have to be in a, your health zone. It's something is a little bit uh, uh, away from the other in uh, a proper distance. You, you don't have to be over uh, away or very uh, near. Oh, so, so, doctor, you mean like... Yes. This okay. is a balance. Yes, ah, yes. So it's a balance. Yes. Like, you have to balance all of this. This is why you put it in the middle. We try to learn how to yeah. balance between yes and yes or no. Thank you. So, share with others our idea. This is your space and this is the other space. The common space is, is the, your boundary. You are the responsible one, actually. It's not me or the other. You are the responsible one who maximizes the space or to minimize or either to eliminate this space, to not to share anything with this person or this community. Okay? Yes, please. Now, these boundaries, do you tell the people around you, and these are my limits, or how do you pass it to them? Thank you for this question. We don't tell the others, hi, this is my rules. Okay? By from treatment, from the experience treatment, they can know that they will not ask you for a favor unless you have time or have the effort or you will accept. So you put the limits at the beginning of any no, relationship with it's not, No, it's not the, from the beginning. It will take during the experience. When you know someone and it's a very new one for you and he will not 
ask you for a favor or ask you for a money from the first meeting, maybe from tens or one year or two years after he asked you for a favor. Uh, and you want to plead him, and you don't want to say no. So, that's for, from the experience of the question. Yes. <laughs> this is a sort of, by the way, I'm sorry I, to interrupt, but this is categorized as abuse. It's called emotional abuse. Yes, so emotional blackmail. Like I think, like I think... Family member, like your mother or something, yes. keeps asking you something because she knows you're not going to say no. It happens all the time. Exactly. Exactly. And actually, yeah. I advise... <laughs> <laughs> this is my living story. Yes. May, may, I cannot may, say no to her. Maybe. Anybody else there? Fine. Mom, I'm no. Dying, you're not dying. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. 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 All of us actually face like these problems no, from friends, agreed. from parents. And you forced to follow her steps. Follow her, her rules because she is right, no, and you have, have you have no, no choice. But but actually, we don't. Uh, we do have a, a lot of uh, things we can protect. Like how you, your body, your human, your human being is consists of what. Your physical body and most of it water. Most <laughs> of it water. Sorry, I'm joking. I'm talking, I'm talking about your, your human being is consists of your physical body, your brain, your mind, and your soul, your emotions, okay, and your strengths. Actually, your strengths. How to develop this? And to build this with. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Rubir. Yes, sir. I have uh, a question in a formal case, if you allow me. Yes. Uh, did the state say a certain position or a certain title uh, and to apply uh, how people build their own boundaries around themselves? A police officer, by nature, is a very humanitarian, by the way, in, inside me. But based on his title and his position, he built, say, uh, a boundary be, uh, around him that he would be perceived all the time that he is a very aggressive and very rude and so forth. Yes. In order to avoid being perceived by the other that is very lenient and so on and so on. So. What do you think about it? I, th I think the police officer is uh, is at least outside this box a little bit because the rules of his job is uh, forcing him to be uh, sometimes uh, violating others or to be uh, in control with the situation. But we, if we are moving to a manager or an employee, a very little uh, list uh, in employment uh, category, uh, and his man manager forced him to do overtime, overtime, overtime without payment, without appreciation. In this case, you have to say, no, please, this is my rules. You are my, my manager, you are my friend, you are my father, my mother, but this is my rules. Please respect to my area and then my case is not called over time, it's called extra time. Extra time, time yes. means overpay, but extra time without yes. pay. Yes, actually. Because we have a, a different types in our humanity, so we have a lot of types and boundaries of so we have a self steam boundaries and body and physical boundaries and we have energy boundaries like we are tired and you are it's 11 pm and one of your friends called you let's go shopping because I need you but I need rest this is your energy you have to protect it okay 
your client. No one can uh, have your time or uh, force you to give time unless you approve <coughs> it, uh, your money. This is a very familiar situation. This is the end of month. Please lend me 100, 1000. And you really need this money for your family. Your space. This is my room. I love the American culture in this uh, space actually because this is my room. You can't enter my, my room unless you have a permit. Relationships. All these founders are very important to any of us. You can add some boundaries and you can eliminate another one, but this is a common. So other types of boundaries that we can have, like our mental boundaries, we can have like some, some, something like uh, intellectual uh, rights. This is my thoughts. I am the responsible one for the thoughts. I am the responsible one for my emotions, my, my behaviors. My special boundaries, I am responsible to believe what I believe or to have a religion of why, what, I, what I am believing. You don't, uh, or you can't uh, force me for something I am not. These two pictures, this is my body, this is my thoughts. I will tell something to you, I will share you something. When you feel that you need boundaries, if you feel that your life fall about a lot of things you don't really want and miss about a lot of things you really want, so you are in need in boundaries. <coughs> this is a gun. Who, who remembers a gun uh, the last session? When I treat you by a gun and tell you your money or your life. So, you have a choice or not? You have no choice. If you didn't, don't uh, give me your money, I will kill you. But if I ask you for money, or a favor, or time, you can easily say no. Because this is my choice, I am responsible for that. Excuse me, sir. Yes. You said that there is no choice, but here, when you give two alternatives, mean that um, I have the right to choose your money or your life. So here, this advice. Uh, actually, if you refuse, you will not be here to to continue the session. Do it very with this choice. Yeah. Yes. So you can say, give me the money. Yes, I, I say, this is my vote. Your money is, or your life. This is what the AQ means. Adversity quotient. Adversity quotient. You are in my quotient. Adversity. Adversity. Resilience. Resilience. Yes. Because no money or real life, but if I let, let, give me your, some of your time, some of your money, no, I, I just say no. Try, try it yourself. By building powers is important because we know how to determine who may touch you, who have the authority to share with, and who is allowed to enter your phone for dome. Don't be like this photo. They are playing and they, she is caring about pay, all the babies. Huh? You see the babies here? <laughs> the babies and they are playing. She didn't set a, a, a li limits or boundaries. Okay? Here is something that would be very interesting. <coughs> Just not to be a root when you're setting boundaries. Yes, I am a husband. By setting boundaries, I have to see you, to touch you, huh? to hear you, and to keep the other to hear you, and to touch you, and to listen to you, and to speak with you. Okay? To build a fence is this a limit of your life, but keeping protect under, and this is a tent, and you, I am protect. Well, you are hiding. Yes, you are hiding under the table, and you are considering this is uh, your limits. Oh. No. To building a healthy and uh, uh, good boundaries 
is to keep with the other, see you, and to hear you, and to touch you. You are just chair, the ideas, and you are setting the limits, not too high. Fix to set up your boundaries, know yourself well, honor your feeling, honor yourself, love yourself, and like yourself very much, actually. Say no the right way. Be sure that maintain and healthy boundaries need breaks. I'm, I'm answering Shireen questions that it's not from the, the first time or the second time, it's need breaks and breaks, breaks. Touching healthy personal time, free yourself from uh, disease to please, to please the other. Don't commit out to all guilt or application. Here is any our your personal circles you are here, your family, your friends, your people, you meet your strangers. This is a reference for the book. Maybe it's benefit for you. There are a different type of boundaries, type boundaries with kids, boundaries before marriage, and boundaries also in dating. So I want to thank you. What about boundaries in marriage? No, it's not. No, 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 no,